and that's just too little time to request an India visa. Good morning from Spain. My name is Ivana, in case we haven't met. Hi. And all right now we are leaving. We're going back home to Amsterdam. So we're saying goodbye to the wonderful little town of Celebrenia over there. Bye Celebrenia. It's going, it looks like it's going to rain today. So it's a perfect day to leave. Bye Mediterranean Sea. I uh, wanted to make a time lapse for you guys, but it is now 8 a.m. And we really need to head to the airport so no time for time lapse maybe we'll have a wonderful sunrise on our way there so let's go i'm gonna miss having breakfast here my wonderful house stefan is loading in the suitcases in our little toyota i go bye wonderful house from the outside i never showed it to you from the outside did i maybe i did it's so pretty i love those flowers man filling up the car with gas because that's the rule with a rental car you have to bring the you have to fuel it up again after you use it basically Stefan just made me realize I have the biggest luxury problem problem <laughs> in the world because on Sunday this Sunday we are flying to one of the most awesome destinations ever if you follow me on Instagram you already know where we are but um, we're going to be there for a week and I was thinking um, to drop off my passport before I go for the Indian visa but I can't do that because I need my passport to travel of course and when I come back I only have like I have three days before we leave to Suriname and I have to request a tourist visa for Suriname so I have three days for that and that's okay and after that we have two days before we leave for India and that's just too little time to request the India visa. So I have two solutions. Like uh, Stefan said that there is a possibility to re request a second passport. Um, and there's also a possibility to request a 24 hour uh, emergency Indian visa. I, I can go to India like there's, there's like an on-arrival visa for 30 days. But I want to stay for two months. So I want to, you know, see like all the possibilities what I can do to stay longer and I will see if I can delay the the India flight because I don't think it's been booked with two days so that will buy me some time this is ridiculous seriously what are we talking about I have no time to request an India visa this is ridiculous I'm honestly not frustrated I feel so hashtag blessed to have these kind of problems because actually these are the kind of problems I want these are the best kind of problems you can have we made it without any scratches on the lovely car in the end I kind of got used to the car but I still stand by my first statement do not rent a Toyota I go in the Spanish hills don't don't do it and uh, yeah so we're just going to well actually they are going to check the, the rental company is going to check the car for scratches what the guy is doing right now it's quite normal and then we are going to return the car come again okay perfect thank you we'll have a bit of and that's all okay okay thank you some pleasure bye bye it has been done thank you again sunny cars for the perfect service checking in and even with all of the candy the suitcase is still Oh, well, it's not under 20 kilo, but still, it's under the weight limit. Awesome. I'm so freaking sleepy, man. I forgot my purse in the toilet. That's crazy. But um, I think it's needless to say that we really, really enjoyed our local experience with Interhome. We also checked out the prices like for, for next year and stuff like that. And most of the houses, they are like the same level as a hotel or even cheaper. And then you have a kitchen and like everything to yourself so yeah i would highly highly recommend you to check it out uh of course i put the link down in the description below because i loved it it was so much fun
Greece and the Netherlands, winning in life. You know what the good news is? We're gonna be here again on Sunday. If you wanna know where we're going, check out my Instagram because I'm already there. Home sweet home and I have to get right back to work because tomorrow I'm going to sp be speaking at the Erasmus University for a small group of people about traveling and making your dream come true and stuff like that and also so I have to prepare for that and also I have to edit 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 uh, but first like for real though you know me longer than today right I have to take like a 50 minute nap or something just a little nap and then after that I work extra hard and right now we are on our way to a press event from the French mountains so just recently we went there and uh, did paragliding and via ferrata and all these awesome stuff so this is a press event for the winter season now I am not per se a winter person but the French mountains man I love it there so I would definitely like to know more north looking mighty fine i think we need to go over there one of the best terraces in amsterdam by the way when it's good weather you can sit outside nearby the water this is hotel the house was on rosan is back hello rosia <laughs> over here we have cheese french cheese yo so i don't drink but they have beer with shinapi so we had to try what do you think of it yeah, it's quite nice is it hey yeah. look hi <laughs> <laughs> yeah no. yeah <laughs> <laughs> so Dutch. <laughs> Dutch is like three kisses. So, Chinepi beer. This is actually, I think, the first beer that I like. Yeah, it is. I have to say. It's, it's, you, you like it? I like it. Okay. And I actually don't drink beer. I don't drink in general. That's but this is good. Yeah. Welcome in France. Thank you. Merci. <laughs> so, we heard many, many interesting things about the winter season in France. And one of the things that I personally really like is the, um, is the spring skiing so it's warm but you can still ski amazing we have to do that also it's not a french press event if there is not a lot and lot of food <laughs> so we were just discussing the french mountain food everything is potatoes and cheese and over here we have we thought these were just the desserts no nope. we have creme brulee over here and there's actually more pastries over there more dessert over there chocolate blanc it's it's crazy this is the big boss but he's <laughs> he's actually the happiest man seriously i've ever seen look at him everybody becomes happy when they look at you <laughs> you know what this is it's not only sunglasses yeah it's to promote skiing into spring into it's spring. a new season yeah. it's warm yeah you, you know, can ski when it's warm. You ski in pullover with longer day, with a warm day, with so many activities around the ski. <laughs> he knows how to sell it, right? <laughs> <laughs> Every time I hear more about France, I get a bigger love for this country. It's so freaking diverse. I really hope we get to see a lot more in 2017. Maybe we'll even go skiing. What? What? Do you see me skiing? What? <laughs> For now, I'm just gonna go to bed. Remember, so tomorrow, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, there won't be a vlog online. Saturday, I will post a vlog for these four days because on Sunday, we are going to check my Instagram. <laughs> Subscribe to travel along, and if you like this vlog, put a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye.